Hi, my name is Francois Diaz, and welcome to our channel. So, um, you're our Mr. Zambales, right? Could you introduce yourself, please? Hi, everyone. Good afternoon. My name is Michael Alan Fortes. I am 31 years old and the eldest in oh. the batch, and I am representing Zambales province. That's really interesting. You mentioned that you are 31 years old, yes. and why it's only now? Uh, actually, before joining my regional pageant, I was very hesitant because of my age, because I'm already 31. But then I took the risk in joining again, because for the last time, before I retire from pageantry, I want to try for the last time if, it, if I can still make it. So this must be this must not be your first time in a pageantry, if actually, I may ask. Actually, this is not my first time. Uh, I've been to other national pageants as well, mm -hmm. like Mr. Philippines 2016, I joined Mr. Philippines, but then I was not lucky enough to win the title. That's why for the last time I really want to try and join again. So why did you choose MIP as your retiring pageant? You, well, we all know that Mr. International Philippines is actually the biggest pageant when it comes to male uh, pageantry. So I would like to end my journey in pageantry with the most trusted organization in the Philippines. What are your expectations upon joining the, um, the organization, I mean the pageant, the MIPH? Actually, when it comes to expectations, there's a lot actually. I am expecting that I will gain a lot of friends here, that I will gain um, new experiences and new knowledge from different people, from different walks of lives, and from the organization as well. Mm -hmm. Okay, let, let me go back to your um, what you have mentioned a while back, that this is not your first pageant, right? So, um, if you could just um, look back to your previous pageants, what are the lessons, or at least your takeaway, from, that, from those uh, pageants that you can make use in your journey right now in MIPH? Actually, when I joined competitions before, I was very young at that time. That's why I am not that serious during that time, though it is my passion. But, you know, there is a lot of time that you still doubt yourself because you're young and you're competing with those people who has a lot of experiences when it comes to pageants. That's why right now at my age, 31, with all the experiences that I had before, I think this is the right time for me to compete again and hopefully be able to take one of the titles of the certain Okay, just one last question, um, Mr. Zambales. Um, if I may ask you, which one should come first, um, external beauty or intelligence when it comes to pageant? Well, we all know that both are important when it comes to pageant because in the Philippines, Actually, people look at the physical attributes of a person, but I think what is important is that what's inside of a person, the character, the attitude, I think, and if that person is smart enough to show to people that he or she deserves what, it, what she, he or she is fighting for, then I think that, for me, it is more important for you to be smart. But I mean, uh, physical attributes is just you know, outside of a person. You, ha you have to go within the person for you to be able and understand that person. Right. Thank you so much, thank Mr. Thank Zambales. You so much. Thank and you. thank you for grazing thank you. our channel. So, good luck and congratulations for making up, making to the um, official attendance of MIPH thank 2020. You. Thank you, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank sir. you so much. Thank you, thank you. Thanks. Audio Jungle.